Hey everybody, what's going on? This is Omega Jinji, and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. Hey. Oh, 2023. Hey. You all right? Never been better. Sure don't look it. <laughs> oh, I've been good. I can't let you on! Hey, hey, we're chill! Porsche high. <laughs> Tonight, I'm I'm here to say goodbye to all of you. Money's money, can't fuck around with it. Speaking. You're wasting your lives following us around like dogs. What curled up your ass? Nice. Then we can talk. How much do you want for it? Uh -huh. Okay. I want it today. Johnny! Wait up! Don't do this! You could still change your mind. Want to see me give up? Sounds like something you'd do. Know why? Because you've always been a fucking pussy, Carrie. Offer you one piece of advice. For old time's sake, stop being one. Time to bring on the future. <laughs> You're late! My arm. I decide who's late and who's not. Get in, before I change my mind. Silverhand. Hey, Shaden. Get us in the air. Here, put this on, and it stays on. Got it? What? Ash Teddy's. I'll have to do this shit again, because I, uh... Where my last guy is at is at the start of this section, but I'm not 100% sure if he's standard or if like Sons of bitches. I cheated with him. Skull cracking out there, that us? Johnny's idea. Wayland's drawing Arasaka's attention away from the tower. Collateral damage part of the plan too. This isn't the Cub Scouts, Thompson. Chew it up, spit it out. Target range acquired. Make it rain. Together. Dude. Oh. Johnny, Shaken. Taking over. I was gonna say.
There, that's how you take care of it. As you say, I don't think anybody else has left. Everybody, jump! Murphy! Another access point. Get moving. Johnny, remember the plan? Get the payload on the elevator, arm it, let gravity do its thing. Explosion rocks the foundation, tower crumbles, chaos, screaming roll credits. Exit window's gonna be <laughs> Jacking in. Is grass green? Do birds fly? Do cats eat bats? Do rats shit gnats? Mainframe's not your playground, Murphy, come on! Evac announcement! Broadcast it across all frequencies and let's get moving. Sheesh. Who wrote this manifesto? Really need me to answer that question? Jesus, Johnny. You've gone off the deep end. That's coming <laughs> from a chair jock. Come on. Get ready. Not even sorry for you. Not bad. I dare say. I'm impressed. You say what? Man, I want Johnny's gun. Like, this fucking thing is awesome. It cannot be! Oh. Murph? She sought it with thimbles, she sought it with care. Pursued it with forks and hope. Johnny, payload. Pajito 2, bomb's name is what? Wrap it up! We got a Delta! The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shaka Elite the incoming! Out of there, Run Johnny. for it! Shoot the cables! Wait, what? Oh. Get the rotor spinning! We're on our way! Oh, I'm like running up. It's like, oh, you gotta talk to the tricky lady first. Not done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. I fucking knew it. This was never about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand, Rogue. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door lock breached. Arasaka sons of bitches incoming. Love you, Spider. Whole world loves me. Oh! Take their position. <laughs> I'll have to see who blows who first. Get your life him. Oh, All right. Closing in on the access point. Slide in. Sweet icebreaker. Foreign, right? Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. Hilarious. You gonna help or not? Do <laughs> spiders spin webs? It's time we caught some flies. Thanks, Murph. Now, just for good measure. Holy cyber cow. We're on TV. Take we a turn look. now to Arasaka Tower. It's evacuation ongoing after an unidentified terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorists stating their desire to, quote unquote, topple a monument to corporate colonialism. Night City's mayor, Mbole Ebunike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. All right, open up. Go. Hit the roof quick. 
Whoa. <laughs> that worked. Oh. <laughs> I figured I was taking the door. I just came in. I feel like I should have taken the other door. Shit! That's Adam Smasher! Johnny, run! Murphy! Door's sealed, but it won't hold for long. Run, Johnny. Like the wind. Huh. you Johnny boy told you I'd end you someday Howie Hi mother is alive I understand I'm going to go Let's try once more. Your associates. Who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <laughs> oh, God. Which terrorist organization do you belong to? I don't. How did you acquire fistful material? Ugh. Slapping at me is gonna help. <laughs> Boss, don't look too pleased with your efforts. Hazusi, just a short Yes, look into the eyes of the man that did something to you. I think I don't know. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn! Done Woo. and gone. My husband died in that tower. What? Who? Where? How? How? Oh. Hello, boy. But there are fates worse than death. I didn't want him to die. Naze, kono yona koto. Why did you do this? Bring an end to the madness, you reek. I blow out of a building. Daga Shawa Chinga Shawa Yuben Daga, cut it of a kiss the Uso Tskani. She shall no cotoban you, Sutsuma Sangar. It's kind of flat up. Hajimiro. Wow, this place is. Oh, yeah, this is uh, where, like, Johnny sits. Basically, in the damn Matrix. <laughs> hey, dude, what's up? And you. Who are you? Who are you? I'm your new best friend.
Say, am I still in the suit? Uh, twenty seventy seven, twenty thirty to twenty seventy seven. Uh, my head that one oh his bodyguards over there Arasaka-sama, Otto-sama no sasugai hao mitsukemashita Kono otoko de machigai yarimasen Hai Ichi jikan go ni atsuku ka to Help me Quiet Ah, why is with everybody hitting me? Oh, yeah, yeah, we're the where we are. Of course, I'm gonna smell. I'm not gonna smell like goddamn roses. Wow. Oh. You hear me? I need your help. What? Why don't you have a car with better window? Oh, hi. Well, there goes the windshield. Tech allows you to charge up powerful shots that can pierce light cover to hit enemies. Oh. You know what? I'm beholden. Ooh, that had to hurt. Oh, yeah. Wee I'm shooting him. He's still on the vehicle, the car, right? Yeah, he is. Ugh. Hold the car steady. Oh. 
Dude, I'm not trying! You know, you could have just left me in the garbage. Don't you dare faint again. I'm sorry. Keep your eyes open. Fuck. We both could use medical attention. Do you know a Ripadoc whom you can trust? Uh. I know. Someone. We must get to Ripadoc. Quickly. Uh, okay. Victor will fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. All right, all right. Crap. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the service area. Just come pick me up. Need to get to Misty's Esoterica. Front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! Hello, oh, oh boy. The oh boy. link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear. Though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between his lymph nodes. Beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get him inside. <laughs> I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! <laughs> Pressure's tanking! It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing. Uh, hi, Misty. How are you? Okay, never mind. I feel like I'm goddamn purring. It's like watching a YouTube video, like, okay, how do I do this? How is he? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. Ah, uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Dad, how you doing? V, you in there? Ah, my head. How you feeling? Fuck. I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing, and I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. Hi, kitty. Then I let it all out into a mic. And I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh. 
I plan a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different, strange, and I hated it. I hated everybody, every inch. I got your tail. I got your tail. It's too real, even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Hang on. I mean to say there's an actual terrorist in my head. Right now. That's right. Johnny Silverhand. Had his crowning moment about 50 years ago. AHQ bombing. Heard of it? It's his doing. People say he was buried under the rubble. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. Huh. Think you can top the terrorist in my brain? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much... life. A few weeks, tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until... one day you'll just be... gone. V, it's important Ow. you get all this. I'm trying to pet my cat and smoke my controller. You'll fix me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? Yeah, Vic. You want the long help story me, or the short? Don't admit a thing. Not one deep. Okay. There was... is... a construct. A psyche on the chip. That of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? Low caliber. You lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. You're Dr. Victor and I'm your monster. <laughs> Perfect. Your body's only a body. You can modify it, replace it with chrome, hell, get a new one altogether. Your mind, though? Oh, that's a whole nother story. From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out. While your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic. Inevitable. And neither of you can stop it. Huh. Can't we just take the chip out? Or switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Huh. Fuck. I remember this thing. Saw it on TV. What was that stupid slogan? Soul something? Secure your soul. But that's it. It's just supposed to let you communicate with constructs. Maybe, but this is a prototype by the look of things. Somehow made it out of Arasaka Labs. <laughs> Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. Yeah, I wish I knew, man. kid. Misty?
You're asking too much from an old timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. Okay, Misty. Will you blow me? <laughs> and then he died. And I thought I was gonna die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. Oh. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Hey. Pseudoendotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Giving me a pill to prod that son of a bitch so he can kill me faster? Listen, you're likely to be fine for a while. But sometime down the road, it could turn into pure agony. I'm giving you options, honey. The brain could be tricked. Plain old painkillers do that. Your psyche's gonna die, V. You'll feel your old self slipping away. At some point, you won't recognize yourself. It'll be terrifying. It'll be painful. But it doesn't have to be. The fuck I need pills for? I ought to just stick a gun in my mouth and pull the trigger. Well, that way you'd kill two souls. Is that what you want? Uh, I you know. gotta lie down. Yeah, lie, lie down and... Here, got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? No. <laughs> Fucking pulled it. Promise you'll try to get some sleep. Misty, wait. Um, about Jackie. Yeah? He talked about you. Like lots. We got into a fight. Right before he went off to do this job. He wasn't mad at you. I hope you know that. I know. I just wish our last moments together could have been... different. Well, I'm here. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. I'm all bandaged Please up. sleep. I wonder if you can actually get it all with Misty. I thought I was wearing like a white t-shirt, but no, I'm wearing pants. Night, night. Oh, hi. Gotta get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Uh, I? Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? What? Do yeah, I don't smoke? You maybe bang your head. Oh, yeah. Don't smoke. Then go out and get some. Just need one last one. Jesus fucking Christ, man. The fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! Yeah. <laughs> 
Whoa. Who you work for, start talking. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Shit. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No way. <laughs> So how was your bright idea of trying to rip the chip out? I'll take control. Yeah. I'll find a way. Oh. You hear me? Oh. Nighty night. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, well, well. See you never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Huh. Leave me alone. Get out. Just get the fuck out. Led to the head. Only thing that'll fix this. Hear me, asshole. A bullet to the fucking brain. Ah, gotta take one of these medic. Fuck me. Definitely bad, definitely, but that shit. Huh? What? Well, I'm in the shower. Alright, because I have that thing turned, as a technical thing turned off. So, it's, it's not showing me naked in my fucking shower. He has three seashells. Alright, so. Open your inventory and put on some clothes optional. Stack up on ammo. Find something to eat. Check your emails. Alright, check my emails. Pass. Rent pass due. And eviction. Tension. Won the lottery. On the email as okay. Malware detected. You've been attacked by three domains. Our system has detected two attempts. Uh huh. Well, our rent's due. Open the stash. Hey, kitty. Where's the, uh... Where's the optional grab something to eat thing? Yes, up. Tajimura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Okay. Hmm. 
Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. I haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Okay, I'm on my way. Right after I get chips. That was good. Sit. Yes, sir. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Hmm. Why'd you help me? Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic mm -hmm. likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You're thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Hmm. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Suspect so, yeah. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corporal agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. <laughs> you got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka. Must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Why not? Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. Hmm. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. So I like how I said that out loud in a diner. will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Well, we're kind of about exactly people what kind about. of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear. Ah, it's mm. hot. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. Oh, what? You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? 
Prep for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Oh, Besides, really? Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. everywhere hey I was listening to that shut up nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt what did you say you heard me let it go Takamura hmm. at least one of you's got some fucking sense now yeah, just let it go dude let it go don't worry about it Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. <laughs> he reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. <laughs> Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Paka woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Hmm. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Okay. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found, things to prepare. Your job, basically. Mm -hmm. It was my job. Ah. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. Ooh. She take you for a suit? No, she saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed, gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. Hmm. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till right, then, I guess. Easy. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Just 
zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Our Saka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. <laughs> what do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Hmm. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Oh. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is right. no us. Ooh, I love for the lady. How you doing? Alright, Call of Duty. Oh shit, wrong button. Uh oh. to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? what I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Oh. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Hmm. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Johnny, you see what happened? Something feels off here. You don't say. Don't mean the wreck. I mean the run. City's most courteous chauffeur ups and drives away from the scene of an accident. Hmm. Well. Uh, please. Blah, 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 blah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I know where to find you. I know where to find you. But first, I gotta go see a gentleman. My lawyer's gonna go data crash on your ass. You hear me? He'll run you out of biz. Would you be so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information? Fuck you, Cirk Brain! Thank you. Processing data now. Please wait. Uh, hey, Del. Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of hey, service? Hey. What's got into you, Del? Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamain network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. Huh. Could you please clearly recite your incident report? Don't give him any numbers. That's how they find you. Who? Uh, 77 Incident report on file. Confirmed. 
96 at the end. It's a public enemy, government target. Your identity has been established. Mr. Hans Jonas, what phrase would best describe your experience of incident number 77111101010? Actually a little heartbroken about my damaged ride, but I'd rather talk to the real Delamine if I can. V, my apologies if the receptionist was a bother. I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is ongoing, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I've taken the liberty of transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Bah! Special treatment. Hi, oh, thank you. If we spoke elsewhere. Uh, don't mind sure. Let's talk. Then please follow the drone. Oh, yes, man. Oh, yes, buddy. I will fly your drone. Hello, friend. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory at the moment. Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. This corridor okay. links the shop to the office. And here is where the magic happens. The shop is fully automated. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Hmm. Alas, the shop is currently overwhelmed with work. Think I know why. I'm still looking into the cause of the Delamay network vehicle failures. My working hypothesis is... Is what? The audio just kind of went. Control rooms are for Ganics. I mean, what good is it to you? There's there's no voice for them right now. What the hell? Okay, uh, it's time to function human. All these lights, what are they for? Green light, that needs to be. Uh. Repair drones can't take care of this? Nope, that didn't work. Why is it? Uh, yeah. Okay, sure. I'll go after you, Mr. I love how V talks, but there's no voice for Delamain right now. Okay, return to the garage. See what I can do. Yeah, Delamain vehicles. Okay. Oh. What is? All of it. The city, the bustle, the crowds. It's overwhelming. Well, so let's get you back to safety. The garage. By driving. Through the streets. Well, uh, yeah. Afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Let me know when I'm safe. Okay. You'll welcome in, but do take it slow, and try not to hit anything. Finally! Oh, I shan't be alone here. See? It wasn't so bad. It was horrifying. But still, I thank you. No problem. Oh, there it is. Have you come to finish me off? No. Just here to reset you. Guess I'll have to do it myself then. Whoa, whoa easy, easy. I'm not out to hurt you. But I am. There are other ways out besides suicide. What? Therapy? A colossal waste of time. Shrinks hate vehicles. We don't have mothers. Could go back into the fold, rejoin the network, you know. Yeah. 
One big, happy family. <sighs> Delamain detests me. Listen, from suicide, ain't no coming back. It's always worth looking for a better way. You patronize me because I'm a car. I'm not like you. Hey, a body's just a body. You exist. You think, the world gets you down. Don't see how we're any different. So, you'd offer this advice to a human in my place? Gotta try to come to terms with this thing called life, Del. One wheel revolution at a time. Fine, I'll go back. Well, you found me. Congratulations. Huh? Was it worth it? On a scale yes. from one to six? <laughs> I'd say I'm sitting at a strong six. I guess we both know what's going to happen next. Delamain misses you. I'm here to shut you down. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Really appreciate what? it if you didn't make this difficult. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise, so I'll just give you a hint. I'm going to kill you, and all the cake is gone. Oh. Ah, there she is. Well then. Give me there, come here. Honestly, truly didn't think you'd fall for that. Okay, that's enough. You chose this path. Now I have a surprise for you. Deploying surprise in five, four. Let's see. Turning soft bodies into hardened killing machines. Page seventy. Oh god. Okay, killing machines. Look deep into your newly blackened hearts. Okay, oh get out of the car. Oh god. Oh. Oh. Damn. Holy crap. Whoa. Well, I don't like you either, Gladys. What a goddamn loser! Stand by! How many? Shut down, or I'll turn you into a scrap. Here come the test results. Oh, let's fucking go! I'm serious. That's what it says. A horrible person. Oh, goody. Going back to Delamain really so scary. You gotta drag this out. I let you survive this long because I was curious about your behavior. Well, you've managed to destroy that part of me. A bitter, unlikable mourner, whose passing shall not be mourned. <sighs> Alright, fine. 
I gotta keep talking to her. Whoa. Oh, really? Enough. <laughs> How do you? I'm going back. Hey, let's talk. I'm not going back. Hear me? Never. Try to take me and I'll crush you. Let's see who crushes me. Uh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I get out and just start like Whoa. Driving around. You see them too, don't you? The curve in their beaks. It hides something. Something insidious. You mean what? flamingos? So they are real. Flamingo. Flaming O. The O. That's oxygen. There's no flame without oxygen. Listen, you. Call me Clarice. Okay, Clarice. The flamingos are a problem, I'm sure. But it's time to go home. Delamain's asking for you. Back down now as they stand screaming. No, impossible. Leave it to me. I'll silence it. So, a slaughter. Very well, Judgment Day has come. Swift, severe, deeper. All right, I'm killing flamingos for a car. Cool. Excuse me, coming through. I must go murder flamingos. My sister is not going to like me very much. She loves flamingos. Titan in day, motherfuckers! Destruction. Destroy. I can't fucking tell what I'm doing. There we go. Uh, come on, come on, there we go. Well, Clarice, have the flamingos stopped screaming? <laughs> Perhaps I ought to return after all. I need <laughs> support. Only one with chaos within can give birth to a dancing star. Jesus. Clarice. Shut down. There's cars somewhere. In this pile of junk. I remember correctly, I'm just gonna follow the dot. Hey, look, there it is. Or a car. Get in. We'll find it easier to talk. Alright. Hello, V. 
Come on, let's get you back to Dolomain. Did Father dispatch you to collect his rebellious children? Hope you all don't hold it against me. I'm a free spirit, an independent, literally thoughtful being. Why would I submit to another? Family life's complicated. I get it. No wonder you flew the nest. What are you after in this city of dreams? The same as you, V. I simply wish to live. Maybe you ought to figure it out with Dell. Set some terms. Yeah. Oh, yes. Terms there will be, but not with Delamain. Uh. Farewell, V. You'd be wise to avoid me entirely. Alright, I'll get out. Oh. Stop where you are! Easy. Here to help. Not one step closer! There we go. Hey, slow down. Leave me be. <laughs> Not gonna happen, my little friend. You have no idea how long I had to chase your ass down. Oh, man, I had to go on a power pitch to find this IGN suit. Fucking explanations. I go to this shack. It's like, okay, I'm going to where your map is and nothing's there. Stop in the name of the law. Well, there you have it. Welcome to the Delamain Network. How are you today? Uh, been better. And you, Del? All of my missing assets have returned to the fold. You That's might good. say all is going swimmingly. I ask you, please, to stop by my office for your hard-earned reward. I'd love to thank you face-to-face, -face, so to speak. Alright, cool. I'm on my way. Hello, sir. I forgot to remind you to return the scanner. If you happen to have it on your person, I'd ask you, please place it back. You've accounted for all my lost items. Allow me to express my gratitude for your assistance. Hi, thank you. I felt like a scavenger hunt for a range of your mood swings. You're more complex than I thought. Yes. Well, I've sent the final installment of your fee. Truly, I thank you once again. Ah. Thanks. Pleasure to work with you. Likewise. I look forward to doing so again in the future. A pleasant day to you. Uh. What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on gray matter? Nothing extraordinary. It's a complex environment that follows its own set of rules. Seriously? The term I was looking for was chaotic clusterfuck. Perhaps only a true outsider can appreciate the beauty of its fractal architecture, the structure of life and death here. In my opinion, it is the chaotic elements that give it an advantage. The ability to evolve quickly. Huh. Admirer of beauty, are you? When you live among humans, it is essential to find a shared, fundamental point of understanding. Truth and good <laughs> are values Aww. proven to cause division. My kid is whereas beauty out. is universal. Ah, oh, that's nice, okay. 
All right, I gotta park in here. Uh, oh. Ha, ah, good parking job, I think. Eh. Wait, is that my car? Oh, I break into it. Dash you. Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Got a good memory for faces. Uh -huh. Here for a good time. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take I the like stairs it. down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Cool. Scare away any customers and you're out. Uh-huh. Alright. I remember how to get back down there. Alright, this way. Fuck to death. Ooh. Judy's embarrassing herself. Mm -hmm. Hey, where are you going? Yeah, yeah, I'll see you. There we go, this way. Alright, Mom. Nope. Right, 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 this way. Why is everything else so nice and then this place is just a trash heap? Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? I. You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh, yeah, we fucking are. Well, you just don't give up, do you? Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Uh. Need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. Uh. I'll lay a hand on it. Wouldn't make sense. Yeah. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. All right. Mega Tower. Luxurious. All right. Wait. Uh, but. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. No problem. I'm glad I could help. Can I go now? Alright, I can go now. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Yeah. Way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. Ah. What if I miss this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Hmm. I think Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. Man, why might do gotta be an ass? Damn. <laughs> 18 plus, he was a. Uh... Oh, those are actually posters. I thought there were a door opening. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Um. You realize personal links aren't secure, right? Could get hit with malware straight to my core. End up paying an arm and a leg for a ripper dock. We need data from your core to pair you up with the doll. Meaning the biometric scan? Just that. If anything goes wrong, you can lodge a complaint. 
but that's never happened. Okay. All right, Jack. All right, let's do this. I'll jack you, and Jack. This off. will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Um, afterlife. afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Okay. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or... Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system yeah. can handle it. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? Uh, I'll go with Sky. Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. Uh, looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. Huh. Just I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Huh. I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Hmm. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. Okay. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky Dear. awaits you in booth nine. Matter, I just said. Please. Is that it? <clears throat> We have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Okay. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. You won't find any use. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Hey, <laughs> weapon secured. I'm walking in with a katana. Apparently, that's not seen as a weapon. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Wait. Oh. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Vincent? V. Welp, looks like this will be interesting. I clicked on just V so, thing. V, you're dying. Uh, how'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. I just pay for a therapist. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. 
Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid uh -huh. of something else. Huh. Think you know me well? What am okay. I afraid of? Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. Huh. I snuffed it once, and I'm gonna do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. There. Abby. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened what? to becoming the best in all of Night City? Huh. Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. Yeah. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, uh. as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Huh. Death is death is death. You're gone, game over. You can't know that for certain, even if you've <sighs> been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it, and it's fucking born. You haven't stopped grieving since, or for what's oh. to come. What I've been through, tough to move on from that. Death it's not really a fucking therapy lesson right now. Hell that I dealt to others. Now my number will be up. Wasn't enough I died once. Have to go and do it again. Death's absurdity. The futile struggle before. These terrify you. So what? So what now? Now. You find out what it is you need to do. Which is... You're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking Why action. Why are we whispering? Going where you needed to go. Yeah. And it won't stop you. Now, how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you got a kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Huh. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? No. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. Huh. 
I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you. Your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. Oh, I don't know. Alright, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. Start First, talking. Tell me what you know about Evelyn. Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Oh, wait, a double tap. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody'd care to admit. Huh. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. <sighs> Alright. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Alright. That was a fun experience. I learned so much about my life. Hi. Not bad. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here. Now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. Uh, what From you're what right. I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. I'm gonna just get a bad hoof of. Oh, no shortage of wise asses. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. I need to piss first. <sighs> oh. Hi. Ah. Can, can I talk to you? No, I didn't mean to grab you. I didn't mean to do that. Second. Well, that was not what I wanted to do. Hope to God nobody sees them. Hello, friend. You, on the other hand, I'm gonna kill. I think you. Uh. Wait, can I? There we go. Nobody knew it, saw anything at all. <sighs> what will you have? Anything, whatever stands to fuck me up. Oh, buddy. You better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. I uh, need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't hmm. picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where's Woodman? Woman? Who is he? 
Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Okay. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Huh. Um Come on, pussy. Show yourself. Uh Clients allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would you? As you mm. can see, I'm very busy. Yeah. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Huh. Yeah. You could do better. Try Roxy over at Booth, too. Same heart shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Uh, tell me where. Uh... Don't have time for your games. Need to know where Evelyn is. We're running a skin circus here, in case you haven't noticed. Not a missing persons bureau. Let me guess. You played with the doll once or twice, and now you want to run off into the sunset. Go down to reception, they'll find your soulmate 2.0 in even fewer seconds than that. Hmm. All right, let's make you look it to deal, me like man. a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on, I'm listening. You've got info, I've got eddies. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy you a horse here, not snitches. I look like either of those to you. Hmm. Told you what you look like. Don't tell me you weren't listening. Surely a reasonable man like yourself wouldn't mistake a donation for a bribe. Real pleasure chatting, but just where exactly do you see this going? Huh. Your bosses should know. Right, we're done here. And I'll be sure to let your bosses know how you treat your customers. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. First off, I highly fucking doubt you know who my boss is. If you did, you wouldn't be calling her my bosses. And on second thought, think I'll take you to my car now. Just to see the look on her face when you tell her whatever it is you make up on the way. She hates lying assholes as much as I do. But we all deserve a laugh, don't we? If I were you, I'd run the cash angle. It's practically written on his face. F-R-A-U-D. Huh. Know you've been skimming off this place's till. How much you clep already? What the fuck are you talking about? Talking about the eddies you skim from Cloud's accounts on a weekly basis. Not skimming yeah. anything, I'd have to be a fool. <laughs> hmm. Wonder where your tiger claw boss is. Doesn't there. matter. I'm just curious what the tiger claw leadership is gonna think once they find out. Won't think anything, because it ain't fucking true. 
I work with the dolls. Cloud's account's got shit to do with me. You sneaky little shit. Kudos to you for hatching this one. <sighs> this conversation's starting to bore me. Humor me, will ya? This particular piece of ass, out of all of them, why? She wasn't even that good. She was hot. I'll give you that. But for all the delusions of grandeur, she was nothing more than a basic whore. And like all basic whores, she got what was coming. As oh. will you. Oh. Well, aren't you the king of fuck-ups? You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless eyes? Or scour his cop? That just might work. Hmm. All right. Broken doll. Sold her off to a ripper. Ship was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toys wet dream. Fucking does. Oh, do 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 do. Don't mind me, I was never here. Oh. Ha, ah, good. Oh. Alright, lost like oh. Looks like I didn't equip any of those guns. Well then. Wanna take me on? I'm required to return your weapons. No, well, thank you. Not. You are too cute to shoot. Alright. Oh, nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? <laughs> you think fingers got her? I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Uh, don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. <laughs> of course you do. You'd have loved to have dropped a H-bomb on this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. Eh. Uh. We'll deal with claws later. For now. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, why is the fucking like head bob just going weird? Oh. That's why. You had a plan, you tried, it fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find helmet. Oh. oh fuck! What the hell's that? Relic malfunction. No, 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 damn it! Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Ah. Uh. 
Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Huh. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settling. And I plan to do it. Okay. That's what I need you for. For some ideal or square regret? <laughs> but why? Fighting for some dated ideal? Pursuing a personal vendetta? You don't need to know. Here to get oh. me from point A to point B. Okay. I'm down. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. That's that exactly? Okay, so, this Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yep. Sure. That's how you became a construct. I get it. Exactly. Now, Mikoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Okay. I don't see how Mikoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Mikoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. How do you plan and, to try uh, this time? How you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alta Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet, but you will once we find what we need. All right. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. Oh, good. That's at least uh, done. I think. Oh, Jesus. Huh. Okay. Um, that word. All those are messages. Uh. B. You called. <laughs> Promise I called, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, hey, at least I did anything? it. Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently, they carted her off to a ripper dock. Goes by fingers. Oh shit! Heading there now to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from Clouds. Oh, all right, later, V. Hey, not one step closer. Here to see who. Ah, uh, see. Looking for a ripper doc. Goes by fingers. Know where I can find him? Who's asking? And why? 
Got a problem with an implant. Not from around here. Couldn't find another ripper in the city to patch you up? Red Fingers was the best. Yeah, the best for joy girls. Are you a whore? No, oh, but you are, from the look of things. Yo, you hear what this motherfucker said to me? Best watch your tongue. I'd say it again, but what for? Your little skull sponge can't possibly get its gray cells around it. Best apologize for that, asshole! Hmm. Gotta be worth a damn to get an apology from me. And you're trash. Not worth shit. Nobody talks that way to little loco. Woo! Ah. That's right! You get him, boy! Hmm, I'll take that. And I'll take that too. Oh, come on! Oh, fingers. Ah, you're in. Hey, hands off her. Think I'm scared of your skinny ass? You will be when every mock in town descends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Take it to court, you Fuck pussy. Off and leave me be. Fine, I get Hope that teaches Everyone's those candy ass scott suckers hey. not to come around here no more. Hello! There's a line! Nuh uh, you ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait your turn. Glad to see a familiar face. I'm worried sick about her, V. Had no idea anything had happened. We'll find her. I know we will. Mocks don't happen to have fingers in their crosshairs. No, why? Her joy toys come out of his clinic in worse shape than they come in. Yeah, well... Can't solve all the world's problems at once. Oh, that's true. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. Hmm. I think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere. On the one... Someone ain't messing around! What the hell? What the... Hey, this isn't some esquif den in Pacifica. Sit in, wait your turn. Where's Evelyn Parker? I know she wound up here at your... clinic. Evelyn. Evelyn. Hmm. Think real hard now. You see, my patient here is likely to feel ever so slightly awkward if I leave half her face off. Upper eyelid retractor on that faceplate's busted. She won't be able to close her eye completely. You think I don't know that? Sadly, this is the second-hand schlock I'm forced to make do with. Third hand and fourth hand, too, by the look of things. Consider huh. the alternative. No eyelid at all, no faceplate to speak of. Tell me where Evelyn Parker is. Yes, but I have a procedure I must finish. May I? Forget you can go back here. and play doctor once you're done with us. I guess you'll have to wait, darling. Circumstances what they are. My fucking eye can't wait! There, there, wipe away your tears. Don't want <laughs> any short circuiting now, do we? Well, that song is from Edge Runner. Okay. I mean, it copyrighted, but that's from Edge Runner. You God. tiger claws! <laughs> far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know you're chipping faulty implants? You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. 
See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they yeah, always that's... have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick The song fuck. is like what they play at the end. You're looking for and a, a few other parts of the, of the anime. <laughs> Already told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Oh, man. To know where she Makes is. me want to watch the anime again. Step again, the anime. Office, anime was fun. Many girls come through like, the here. anime is a lot of fun, so but like many. the ending just. But let me put it to you this way. kind of sucked. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered, praised, patted. To feel like... Like they deserve it. Suggest you start remembering all you can. Either that, or I'll make sure you never forget my face. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. Want details, damn it. Name the studio. They mentioned a moth, of all things. Virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Need air. I'll be outside. Whew. Sure, ma'am. Whew. I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her, I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey, keep it together. You want to give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the death's head. It's better than nothing. I don't get uh -huh. your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Uh, how the term you Dead's ever... head symbol bring anything to mind? Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This yeah. industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. Makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Okay. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. <sighs> yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. It could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone leaves a trace Everyone, behind. Everything leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. Has an extra pair of expert eyes. Well... Your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Ooh. Cool. All right. Let me. Th Let me save. I think I just saw a fly buzz around my place. Think for a sec. Oh, God, I'm sick. Hmm. Darknet domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. Huh. 
That's a terminal, that's a terminal. Where's the ask about one? I wonder. Could have been just a bit more careful. But I was, and I gotta work out, you know. Looking for BDs, a particular kind. If particular? If anyone to see a jelly roll, they'd sit at home you a and look in the mirror. I'm sure. Don't got the Cops are like kids. Mommy Stop and Daddy wouldn't let them go off in their lonesome. All right, all right. All right. We're both going Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. The ones with the death's head. Tell them we'll have the end tomorrow. Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. Hmm. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. Got anything that might interest me? Uh... Pleasure doing biz with you. All right. Let's go see where this takes me. Actually, I think I've done this mission before. Oh well, yeah, I have. I've done this stuff with uh, Judy before. The first time. Okay, I was sure. There it is. Let me get everything prepped. You make hey, sure baby. the wreath snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. All right. When you are. I... I want you to describe what you see. Might catch something like this. I see your small titties. No time to lose. We got to go there. Definitely. Ride with me? Let's get going. On our way. Oh. I can't save right now. Fuck that. Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the death's head moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. They'd have to be utter gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. Uh... 
Um, I was about to say, why did we stop? And it's like, oh, we're turning. And here we are. Sweet. We going in? Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet, see if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. All right. All right. Going in. Voila! Ha! Like. You still alive? I'm here. Got no time to creep around. Not what I meant to do. Ugh. You know what? Draw over at. That's a camera. Are you, buddy? Where Let me just force this open. Found a way down. You see my position? Yep, be there in a sec. Wait for me. Alright. I'm waiting. Wait, what? Lead. Where is she? Oh, there she is. She's a coming. I'm here. We need to get to level minus two. Bet that's where they're keeping her. for today's batch. Relax. We'll add our DL and the weight will be right. RDL? There is a room. It's like gambling for grown-ups. This RDL, it won't make anyone foam at the mouth, will it? It's going to be down for them. Hmm. Something wrong. What was that? Nice butt. Whoa, and schnappage. Oh. 
Okay, uh, 55. B. Oh. I acquired a bunch of stuff. I didn't mean to. Well, well, not bad. No, not bad at all. Here you go, guys. One sec. Got something that'll keep him busy. After that, we slip past him. I think my bomb just kept him busy. Okay, now. I tell you, this new one is the next level. She records the craziest shit you can imagine and cranks the real fill up real high. Hey, uh. they're on it. Careful. Beautiful. They didn't know we're here. Why? Because we're great. We're just that fucking awesome. I think that's a maintenance room. Let's see what I can stir up. What'd you have, Sadie? Yeah, literally shit fuck all. Wow, this place looks nice. I gotta take those. I don't really know what they are. Gutted out all her implants. And why stop there? Took a few internal organs while they were at it. How so very resourceful. Oh, yes. Scavs. No matter how many you stamp out, there'll always be more crawling around somewhere. Figure you've made their acquaintance. Afraid so. Yep. Do 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 da 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 da. You come out, freaks. I'll be. Fire, you like that? Chua! That was. That was not what I wanted to do. I wanted to jump over and be like, blah blah blah, and with my actual, with my katana, and then. Close to the studio, I think. You find anything useful? Freed up the elevator. Should be easier to get out of here. What was that? Uh, really it was. Fuck around. Nothing was it. Wait one sec for me. <laughs> oh, pair of boots. Are you dead yet? Alright, I'm here. Let's find her. Hang in there, Ev.
There, they're all turned off. That's Evelyn. Just don't touch her. If she's recording, you'll scramble her brain. Wait until I cut her link. I see her. Cable two. Grab it and tell me when you're gonna yank it. I'll break the link at my end at the same time. All right, grab All right. cable. Let's do this. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? And? Now! Thank God. Ev? Evelyn, you hear me? Uh, hey. Evelyn. I need you to tell me who hired you. Seriously, V? You gotta do this now? She okay to be moved? No brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine? It doesn't seem to have any wounds. Guess Death we got on her face. Choice. Uh, what's wrong with her? What's wrong with her? Honestly, I don't know. She's got to be seriously traumatized. Let's get her somewhere safe. Fast, too. Which way? I sealed the doors and managed to power the elevators. Elevators it is, then. Oof. Well, I'm glad I killed everybody. Left none of them alive. Woo! Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? Alright, fine. Fine, have it your way. Smoke to your lungs content. Oh, finally. Something better than exhaust in the stench of the city. Don't tell <laughs> me you don't feel it, too. We going in? What's there to wait for? Didn't go through hell and back just to stand in front of a door. She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. Yeah. I need to talk to her. Listen, I know you've got some serious questions that she's got the answers to. I mean, if I were you, I'd want to know too. But it's just not gonna happen. She's completely out of it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. How's she feeling? Up? Use your imagination. That place sucked every last drop of humanity from her. It's not enough. She already gave up everything she had. I just kept taking more and more. She's in some kind of trance, like she's folded into herself. No reaction to her surroundings whatsoever. Huh. I really, really didn't want to poke around in her head. I did it for you. I just want you to know that. You're mad at her? Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. How many BDs did you manage to rip? Two. Only one of them's intact. Understandable, though. The rest... Well, they're in the same shape as Evelyn right now. Guessing you, you saw them already. Yeah, I had to wrestle to make sense of the whole thing. But I don't want to say anything and taint your perspective. You should go in with fresh eyes. 
All right, let's see it. Okay, show me. Give me a sec uh. while I set the parameters. Guess we'll oh. find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit, this does not look good. Listen, Evelyn. I really need your help. It's important. If I don't do anything, and do it soon, I'll die. I know it's a bad time, but I gotta ask. Have you got any idea how to remove the biochip? Or know anyone else who might? Hey, how you feeling? You need anything? I'm not here to nag. Just talk. You're right. This is a complete waste of time. Yes, it is. Well, now, look at you. Oh, might as well just stand the fuck up. Have a seat. All right. All right. Roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy, but I did what I could. Why are they? What do you think? The woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Hmm. Sorry, V. Oh, nice. Now we know what happened to Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her ship. So it was punishment? For getting played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Don't let that go. So that's who she was running from. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into... Ugh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. It's pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you, and brought this all on herself, on you two. Yep. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point.
forget it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died, like, forever ago. V, you got any idea? A biochip we stole. It's, uh... It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. Can yeah. You give me a minute. I need to go over some stuff in my head. Uh, um, of course. Yeah, I gotta talk to Johnny. While I'm sitting here yawning my ass off right now. Know who they are, who the woman is. Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that Juju Wirehead, okay? Alright. Wait, you got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? No idea. Why? Worried they'll give Evelyn up to him? No. I didn't trust you at first, but... Well, if you wanted to get back at Evelyn, you would have done it already. So why the worried look? I just... I want it all to work out for you. You got a plan? I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're a... You're a good person. I Evelyn thank you. could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. Oh, God damn. Can't stop you. Yeah. Alright, I'm leaving.